Hello, and welcome back to the Cars.coza studio, where today we are joined by the GWM M4, a car not to be confused with this. The BMW M4. No, this is a small crossover with front wheel drive, four doors, a budget friendly price, and a badge people might not easily recognize. It's made by Great Wall Motors, China's largest independent car maker. The M4 isn't perfect, not much is at this price point. I like the front very much. The back, uh, not so much. But with its impressively high ride heights, black cladding and roof rails, it is pulling off that mini SUV look. And its size and shape puts it somewhere between cars like the Renault Sendero Stepway and the Ford EcoSport. Under the bonnet, you have one choice of engine. It's a 1.5 liter non-turbo petrol, closely related to the Toyota VVTi engine. It has a bit more power and a bit more torque than rivals like the Sendero Stepway and Toyota Etios Cross. But with that power lying quite high in the rev range, you have to drive this quite hard to get anywhere in a hurry. Where the M4 excels is build quality. It feels properly solid in the cabin, appearing well-built and completely rattle-free. The interior is well specced too. Included in the asking price of 189,900 Rand is park distance control, cruise control, steering wheel controls, Bluetooth, a USB, and an aux jack, air conditioning, power steering, and electric windows all round. Where the M4 doesn't do so well is boot space. It's really shallow thanks to an oddly large space which they've allowed for the skinny spare wheel. Now it should be fine on day-to-day -day trips and the seats do fold flat, but for longer journeys with four people and their luggage, that's going to be quite tight. Let's take a look at the M4's rivals. The Renault Sandero Stepway has found favor with SA buyers for its high level of spec. It looks good too, and at 182,900, it is 7,000 Rand cheaper than the M4. But the Stepway represents a very different approach to the M4, featuring a highly advanced, small turbocharged engine, while the M4 is mechanically very straightforward. The other rival we've chosen is the Toyota Etios Cross. At 176,700, it is a good 13,000 Rand cheaper than the M4. But we think the M4 is better finished, and with a 5-year warranty versus the Etios's 3-year warranty, GWM seems to have a lot of confidence in their vehicle. It's closer than you might think between the M4 and the Sandero. My colleagues at Cars.coza would tell me that the Sandero is much more comfortable for taller drivers, but I don't have that problem. And we do like the Renault's standard stability and traction control. However, this M4 facelift has come a long way and you certainly wouldn't be wasting your time with a test drive. 